Let us think. Let's think big. We can think creatively and take part in global change. Let's live sustainably, develop smart and innovative ideas, be independent and save. Today's solution can lead us to a brighter tomorrow. Let's think choices. Field choices is about the future. Innovation, that means leadership. It's about thinking out of the box. Freedom not to be afraid of the impossible. The ability to choose. Great minds creating a new world. The next generation solutions. Today, modern life is inconceivable without crude oil. Almost everything we do relies on it. And collectively, we consume almost 14 billion liters of oil each day. The initiative started as a vision of the Prime Minister Netanyahu. The idea is that the world is suffering from the dependency on oil, mainly in transportation. And we are here to solve this problem. We aspire to live in a world free of dependence on crude oil, with a wide variety of clean and accessible means of transportation. The goal is to reduce the world's dependence on oil in transportation. Israel acts as a catalyst to this process. In many cases, we're considered not only the startup nation, but the innovation nation. We have that ability to combine multiple disciplines into one solution, and the oil alternatives is a great example. The government role is to provide all the information necessary and analyze the feasibility and the implications for the integration of the different fuels in the Israeli transport sector. It's about taking all those technologies and combining them into working solutions in the market that can make an impact on the global scale. The initiative was established in order to provide regulatory stability and an investment horizon for market stakeholders and include tools to strengthen scientific and applied research in the field, simplify bureaucracy, and bolster entrepreneurship and industry. We are committed to invest in viable solutions. We promise to be cheaper and cleaner than conventional transportation. It brings some attraction and also brings some understanding for, from different communities to the importance of this field. We are thinking out of the box using this integration as a melting pot to uh, come up with a unique solution. We need to partner with global companies that can bring the technology to the market and scale it up. This is where the initiative gets into the picture. Together with nine partner government ministries, the Fuel Choices Initiative aims to create a business supportive environment through simplifying bureaucratic processes, responding quickly to market changes and needs. It makes use of Israel's interdisciplinary nature and Israeli entrepreneurs' operational agility, as well as the country's academic research power and the exceptional cooperation between academic bodies and industry. The initiative was set up in a way to be able to cover both basic research and technology innovation. We need to mobilize all forces that can contribute to this task, and the Israeli research universities certainly have the capability and the track record to do this kind of attack. The Alternative Fuels Initiative is comprised of operational tools, investor incentives, research grants, and funding to support knowledge growth and industrial development. Micro-initiatives, including the Samson Prime Minister's Prize for Innovation, local and global conferences, and scientific exchanges. By the year 2025, the Government of Israel aims to reduce oil consumption and transportation by 60%. We've decided to embark on a 10-year commitment to fund continuous research and obviously, if we have other partners, then we could actually break through and imagine a world that is not dependent on oil. Industry, academia, and government are committed to a vision that is broader than any single sector or place, aiming to promote global security through market-disruptive transportation innovations, providing new transportation choices for a safer, more rewarding, and cleaner future.